Hello, my name is Nicholas, and I'm an art director with an advertising agency. My job takes me all over the place. Sometimes all I get to see is inside of my hotel room or the client's offices. But other times, I get the opportunity to see a little bit more of a city or a region. And when I do, I often wonder why one place appeals to me and another one doesn't. You see, for me, it's not about an idyllic landscape or a spectacular view. What inspires me are the ties between the natural world, people, and the community. When a place has a unique identity, this is how I'm contributing to my environment. Look, I'm working on this project with a couple of enthusiastic neighbors. Centuries ago, this was a very well-known place. It was a location where trade routes met. And now, we're gonna turn the farm and the surrounding nature into something that we can all share. A lively city farm with vegetable plots for many types of forgotten vegetables, a botanical garden for local plants, and we're also going to make a space for culinary workshops, and we'll have a shop for local produce. The municipality backs us, but that's not enough. You know, we've put together a business plan, and we'll soon be launching our crowdfunding campaign, and we have 5,000 likes. You know, a project like this takes a lot of time, but it's great to get something off the ground with a group of super motivated people. I know there's a lot we can achieve together to revitalize abandoned rural areas thanks to all sorts of people who celebrate the rich local history and culture. Soon our cities will be filled with parks and green spaces, beautifully designed areas where people can relax and enjoy themselves. Our rivers and coasts will benefit from this too, with recreational spaces that are spectacular, as well as having water fit for swimming in. But none of this will happen all by itself. We can't leave everything to the municipalities, to the state. We, the citizens, must fight for it too. And together we can strengthen our cultural identity. That's my perspective. What's yours?